So now I'm going to go to a few nuggets that I want to share with you that I hope you may have gotten out of what I just said. So the first one is show up with a good attitude. <laughs> okay, you all win. <laughs> the second one, be a good listener. Don't be thinking about what you're going to reply with. Hear the person out. So try not to interrupt. Nugget <laughs> three. Be authentic and genuine in your interest in what they're saying. Number four. Ask questions of your peers. If you don't know, ask. Because you can bet you're shooting the video. Anybody know that? Oh, <laughs> you can bet there's somebody in the room that wants to know. They're just afraid to ask. Just, you know, make, make a joke, laugh, and ask what you want to ask. Um, this is my favorite one. In all my negotiations, I always wanted to get to a win win. You never want to meet somebody up to the point where they might turn around and hurt you from behind. If you know what I mean. They may cut corners. They may do whatever they can do just to take advantage of it because they didn't like how to do business with them. So win-win is always the way I work. And I recommend that. The other thing, this is negative number six, don't be complacent. And that's what my reading books and self-improvement, and it doesn't have to be, I mean, it could be in gardening, it could be in painting, something that will help you with your conversation when you come to meetings like this. I mean, nobody wants to talk about football all the time. <laughs> I do. <laughs> Number seven. Well, I've already done that. I'll bet... Um, I'll bet you all here, because I think every one of you is worked in a male-dominated position, right? Am I right? And one is, don't put all your eggs in one basket. I see a lot of shaking heads. Hallelujah. Because I didn't really know that until I wish I had. So, uh, and that's what the self improvement thing is coming from. I'm talking about to you, because there's always somebody trying to take your position. Especially if you're at the top of your game, like I'm sure all you women and men and people are. <laughs> Number nine, <coughs> save for a rainy day. Know your finances. Have a list of your monthly expenses. Have at least 40% of your income annual put aside somewhere for that rainy day. Now, that doesn't count your savings or retirement or anything like that. It's just, that, you know, it's a pretty good number, but it, you just never know when you're going to go. Who did it feel that it was going to Right? It took a lot of money to get to COVID. And number 10, surround yourself with people you respect and admire their work ethics. Because if you admire them, you know you're with the right people. 